touches, three touches, three touches. Down, back, down. Oh, Joe is, uh, you know, to be out here coaching, coaching uh, night before a game. You know, it's almost 11 o'clock at night. We got to, you know, catch a shuttle to the airport at 5:50 in the morning to catch a, a flight to Buffalo. So it's late nights and early mornings. But you know, Joe's character—he's he, all about growing the game. Move it, move it. Too late. Move it. I don't know. I mean, you know, this is this is kind of. The profession I've chose, I, I love being out here and helping these guys out get better. I think, you know, it's fun to see these guys, you know, they're they're out here, you know, it's 11, 10.45 at night, I'm sorry, and, and they're still out here going hard and sweating their butts off out there on the field. So uh, it, it makes it all worth it. You know, we're going to see see how the boys do this year when we uh, strap it up against some, some other competition. These are nece necessary drills in order to take the next step, all right? So I need you guys outside of here all right, to do your work so we can take that next step. Everyone with me here? Yeah. Let's get it done, boys. Call it off. Let's go. Good practice. Good practice. Let's go. So about three. One, two, three. Soda. Soda. First game I ever played in the NLL was, uh, was actually in Buffalo, and it was probably one of the most terrifying experiences of my life because <laughs> the, uh, the crowd is definitely, definitely a factor in there. But, you know, again, I think... Uh, the Buffalo fans are always rowdy, but that actually gets me fired up. I'm pretty sure the other guys feel the same way, so it's going to be a great time. Yeah, we're, we're checking out of here. Minnesota uh, club lacrosse practice. Going to be checking back in bright and early tomorrow morning, uh, probably about six hours, so see you then. Just got to the airport, checking in. About to take off to Detroit. Um, and we're going from Detroit to Buffalo, so it's gonna be a long day. I hate flying. Honestly, got up two hours early, had to get the light rail. Sit on there with a bunch of people who are miserable going to work. I guess it's not that bad because I'm going to travel, but it takes about 40 minutes total to get from my door to here. Little no. NHL 07, the newest one out. <laughs> Alex Ovander Ovechkin, greatest ever. I'm playing solitaire. <laughs> <They're somehow laughs> Cornell. Dominic Hasek's the Sens goalie. The network error occurred. Can I connect to the other player? What'd you do? Do anything. Mikey in suits. Nothing, you coming on the flight or no? Oh yeah, well the, it's boarding last call. <laughs> yeah, you might want to hurry up. Where is it? Yeah, but is it secured? Just landed in Buffalo Airport, you walk with me or what? Is it hard to walk? Sunny Buffalo, you can see in the background. Just uh, pass up Witch Witch, my favorite sandwich shop. Kind of disappointed. Uh, Hurley knows how much I enjoy Witch Witch, but nice big day plan. Ready to go. Go Simpsons, the Lopez show, and Suter show. It's got the late slot right before Leno. <laughs> Why are bags so? Are they wet or is that just oh look how wet my bag is? Is that your room? I hope that's your room. What? Are you kidding me? Oh. Very cute. Open it up, see the stuff in there. Damages. Yeah, you can say it's wet. No way. Joe, what? what do you do about that? Don't wet my bag is. <laughs> Did you actually do that? Rookie. Oh, your bag was in a snowbank. It smells like 
smells weird too. It smells like booze a bit. Yeah. Someone's bottle of booze. Right? Yeah, it's, I, don't, I guess that's what happens when you're a rookie in the NLL. Bunch of funny guys on this play, huh? <laughs> Bag gets up. <laughs> cool, do you have something to do with this? Really? Figure it out soon, let's go. Oh, Mike, you'll get your... I don't you were. Could have been worse. Yeah, uh, I picked the bag up from the combine turn belt and... Uh, Somebody's six pack broke on the way over and leaked all over it. It's gonna be a rough day, you know. Bag's a little wet, alcohol, a little bit of yeast smell coming off of it. We're gonna have to figure stuff out when we get back to the hotel here. Phase one, Mikey with the wash, that's for sure. So on it, take care of it. Keep keep you posted. Let you know how it is. Just Everything you could ever want. Cheesecake factory. Joe knows it. Yeah. Don't go out. I don't like cheesecake. Really? Are you serious? You had the Reese's one? You've never had cheesecake before. No, I've had it. I've had it before. Yes. Now you're on camera. See, now you're on camera. What do you mean? I've never had cheesecake before. <laughs> I'll say it is so awkward. The old rookie salary might get donated to the cheese factory. Yeah, we got a cold meal coming. Switch it up the last second, eh? Yeah. Throw curveballs all order. Oh, oh, Joe so knows what he Samuel wants. <laughs> Samuel Jackson. Hey, eh? so you know, you know what you want. Mm. Always. Let us run. Oh, I need a shout out in a couple episodes. Of what? Joe knows. This is it. We're on it right now. Happy to be a part of Joe's nose. <laughs> Joe's nose. <laughs> What'd you go with? What'd you order? Tell us about it. Uh, yeah. Put down the uh, lunch pasta special, Alfredo, <laughs> with uh, chicken. Cheesecake Factory, built in 1864 by General Custer. Roof painted by Michelangelo himself. Totem poles, King Tut. Inside, living, living the life. Should have gone with the salad wrap. Thai lettuce wraps, I'm telling you next time you're here. Lettuce wrap? Thai lettuce wrap. You will not be disappointed. Joe knows. And Joe knows. Brandon Turner, he plays on my summer team. He works at my Lindsay, yeah, I asked him. I'm like, I need a stick. I met up, met up with him today. That's what he gave me. That's nice. Yeah. Did they that right? stuff? He loves, he's a huge yeah. stick doctor. Oh, yeah. Oh, Danny, did you drive? Yeah, I did. Who are you with? Kimmy. Kimmy. You, you want to come? Do you even go luck here? Suits. And by mistakes. Huh? I made a few. Yeah, we we just we just pulled out though. New York. This segment is Joe doesn't know. Joe does not know where he's going. Alright. This is CD number. It's just on the radio we're rocking out right now. We're gonna be back. That was great. He's gonna make uh he's gonna make a left turn right here. In the year three thousand. Oh baby, I didn't practice. It's 10 o'clock at night. It's a long day of travel. Not exactly the ideal practice situation, but do what you gotta do, you know? Let's 
go, boys. One, two, three, two, three four. Four. At this point, we got a good sweat in tonight. When, uh, went kind of hard, but it's good. I'm ready to go home, maybe grab a quick bite. Yeah. My GI was saying in practice, instead of carrying it down low, if we pass it down low, that, that double's not effective. When the ball gets loose or it gets tied up in a stick, you struggle, okay? Keep the ball high, move off ball. Oh,